Hello everyone, this is Lorraine and today I'm coming to you with a like a first impressions Oh, chip daggone polish. Ain't this about nothing. Sorry. Um, um this L'Oreal, sorry, the Voluminous Butterfly Mascara. Um, I couldn't wait to try this out. I got this yesterday. I think I got this from Walgreens. Yeah, I'm almost positive this one was from Walgreens. So I wanted to try this out. And um, since we didn't go anywhere else after, um, after we came back from hauling, um, I figured I'd just wait. I have to go back and do a little bit of ripping. Rip, sorry, I'm trying to get this daggone package open. Um, a little bit of ripping and running today. So, and since I don't generally like to leave the house anymore without um, mascara, I figured since this would be a great time to try it. Sadly, the packaging, oh my god, I mean, it's, it's a good thing that it's secure, but jeez. I mean, granted, it's just like regular plain paper, but it's like this stuff did not want to come apart. So basically, let me read you the claims. L'Oreal Paris introduces new voluminous butter butterfly mascara featuring, sorry, a breakthrough wingtip brush to lengthen, stretch, and volumize every lash to the outer corners of the eye. The butterfly brush. For the first time, L'Oreal Paris creates an asymmetrical wing. tip brush featuring a unique shape to catch every single lash from corner to corner and flexible arches to lift, lift at the outer edge. The new formula is infused with 1.2 millimeter fibers instantly coats the lashes with a soft delicate soft and delicate veil for longer looking silky feeling lashes with up to six times more volume. Every lash is extended for a dramatic lash fringe that flutters. It's clump free, flake free, smudge free, ophthalmologist and allergy tested, suitable for sensitive eyes and contacts, lens wearers tested under dermatological control. Place brush at base of lashes and gently sweep up to the tip. Rem removes easily with soap and water. So that's all that it claims. So again, here is the wand there. That's the one side and then that's the other side of the wand there. So let me just go ahead and get into this. And what I'm going to do is zoom in so you can see a little bit better. Okay. So, and this is how it looks after like coating the brush the first time there you go so I don't know if it seems kind of liquidy let's see I'm not sure if you do one side first so let me just go ahead and try this So it seems to apply fairly nicely, I must say, so far. And I can't get through without making a mess, so you just have to bear with me. So that's using just the small end of side of the brushes here. So I'm going to flip it and use this side now and see how it ch if it what's the difference so it does seem to be lengthening and like seriously like separating them which 
my lashes like are really really weird there are certain spots that unfortunately just tend to gravitate toward each other and they're like always like in the middle on my right eye it's even worse I can generally get my left eye to separate really nicely here in the middle you can see there are a couple that are like trying to crisscross and it is they are starting to stick together quite a bit and mind you this is just one dip into the into the um the tube so hopefully after a couple days like i found that some formulas tend to um tend to dry up a little bit which i have better success with the drier um formulas especially with clumping I mean it does look really nice I will say that I am actually pretty pleased with this I mean, it really, oh my goodness, that gives like a great effect. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I, I didn't realize I had it held up so high, but it's, I'm trying out the app that allows me to um, control the camera from my, my iPhone or my iPad. But the only problem with that is that it puts a little line across the middle of the screen that lets you know that it's still connected because it's like you have to use Wi-Fi for it. So it is in kind of the way for me to be able to clearly see, especially with applying mascara. If this were like just a regular, like a haul video or something where I didn't need to really look at what I'm doing, this would be fine, but that line is like right in the way, so I just had a mirror. And so I so I can like really see and didn't even pay attention to the fact that the mirror was in front of the camera. But I must say, enough of the rambling, I am really pleased with how this looks. I mean, and mind you, this is just one. I have not gone back into the, um, the tube to refill my brush and it has given me like so let's like some really nice volume so my right eye is not done but my left eye one coat and look at the difference i mean it is like totally dramatic with just the one pass and it is gorgeous this oh benefit they're real mm, this one might Oh my goodness, so let me try this with one more coat and see. Well, because I like to put on a lot, just but I want to see how when the clumping comes in. And I forgot to bring Q tips with me to clean up my eye because I knew I was going to make a mistake and I knew I was going to get it all over the place. So this is the second coat. Still doing pretty well. Oh. Only thing is that, I mean, it's got a slight curl left to it. Not a whole lot, because I did curl my lashes prior to, um, the start of the video like immediately before I mean it's got some curls not like dramatic so I mean for two coats 
god, that is really, really nice. So this mascara is not only going to go a long way because you don't need a whole lot to, for it to be really, really dramatic. Like literally, this is, I've only dipped in to the tube twice and it has given a fabulous, fabulous effect. So this is both my eyes. Where's my tube? Oh, sorry. Let me try to clean that up just a little bit so it's not distracting. I know I have Q-tips somewhere around here. So, oh, of course my eye would start watering. Well, I guess you can see how well it works. Like if your eyes start watering, it does clump up somewhat on the bottom which I don't know I can't say that that bothers me a whole lot except for like right there it leaves a little bit of a mess but um I mean not bad at all so two coats on my left eye compared to just nothing on my right eye that is really really nice I must say I might have to go get some backups of this one because I really, I mean, it gives a totally different effect than the benefits they're real. And it gives, I mean, you don't need as much and it's just as full. Oh, Lord. Well, you can see that it runs. It will run a little bit if you have watery eyes. So, I would just be mindful of that. Let me zoom out here. Okay, so I am really pleased with the um, L'Oreal Lash Out Butterfly Mascara. I mean, just look at how different my left eye looks compared to my right eye even though this one is generally not open as wide um, just because like due to my effects of my medical condition but um, so the only, only thing I would say is that um, like if you do put it on your lower lash line I don't know maybe put something different because um, as you can see as you saw in the video that it, when my eyes started to water it was running but again that was it was immediately put on I don't know how well it's gonna stay put after a while I don't my eyes always start to water <laughs> unfortunately when I first put it on sadly which is annoying but um, so I'm actually very pleased with this. So hopefully I'll be able to give you an update later or sometime this week on the wear and smudging of it because that smudging and running is just because my eyes started watering like seriously while it was still freshly like literally just applied. So that's going to make a difference. So um I'm very pleased with this. Check this out again. I want to say, I think this was 7 something um, after my 15% discount. So it, under $10. So this is, I, I love it. I'm going to have to go pick up some more of these. So if you've tried this, let me know if you like it. If you haven't, you should definitely try this out if you're looking for something. Um, that's inexpensive that gives you like a really nice dramatic effect I really I'm I'm loving this so let me just do one last close-up and again it's sticking just because my eyes started watering like while I was still like in the application process so um that's it i don't want to get too much rambling too much longer so 
again the um, L'Oreal Lash Out excuse me butterfly mascara at Walgreens for I want to say a regular price I think it's $8.99 um, so very very good very very good good um, price and it works really nicely so check them out let me know if you've used it um, and what you think if you like the way that this looks or if this isn't your cup of tea um, so that's it thank you for watching sorry this is so long and stay polished at all times bye